All right, Dynamite Cop. Dynamite Cop. How you doing today, Shane? Pretty good, pretty good. Yeah, you had an eye appointment, then you came over here ASAP. Came in while I was uh, yeah. eating pizza, watching Dragon Ball Super. <laughs> yeah. But I was going to say, uh, how, did you, how did you go about buying this game? Because I remember this game was in the arcade. And then you were like, oh, yeah, I'm going to get it online or something. Yeah, I definitely bought it online. Oh, no, yeah. It was because uh, those Dreamcast demo discs. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's what. Disc, yeah. We were always playing that demo. And then you were like, I'm going to buy it on eBay and get it. And um, Yeah, it was, I mean, a lot of times it's really hit or miss. But one Christmas, my aunt got me, like, 12 demo discs or something. <laughs> which, you, which you gave to me once I got a drink. <laughs> Yeah. I and I played the majority of them, yeah. yeah. They were crazy, man. They had like six or seven games on each disc, and it was like ten discs. They're, like, dude, it was like 60, 70 different Dreamcast games, demos for all of them. I remember playing that Army Men game. There was some like Suzuki Racing was probably on there too, but yeah, Dynamite Cop was on there. Oh wait, didn't one have, um, didn't one have, what is it, uh, Skies of Arcadia? Uh, yeah, yeah, it did. Yeah, yeah and it had the it three had scenarios, the right? The ship battle, the um, the yeah. train battle, and then the uh, yeah. gladiators, yeah, yeah, which is yeah, hard right. as shit. Yeah, I do remember that. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I remember. I remember playing that before school and owning it or whatever. But okay, but yeah, Dynamite Cop. You know, uh, one last thing I wanted to say was Eris. You know, I sent you. You get that video ever where I sent Eris playing this, uh, I don't avoiding remember. the puddle. Well, he played it, man, and I don't know if it was through Steam or he imported it or whatever, but. The Bruno guy, the main guy, he looked actually like Bruce Willis because in North America, this game was called, like, the first one was called Die Hard. Yeah. And then it was in the arcade and it looked like Bruce Willis. And then it, the next one was Dynamite Cop. This is like the sequel game. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't know what's All up right, with let's that. Get this thing, let's get this show on the road here. All right, do you know what path we're going to take? Oh, probably just the first one. Look at the VMU, man. That old Dynamite Cop logo is in the center. Yeah. It's pretty cool. All right, you can uh, you can go ahead. You're player Let's one. See. I just hope these controllers work, dude. Like, yeah, that'll be fine. That'll these be were fine. buried in a Tupperware container. What is Caribbean? Oh shit! I was like, no, this don't. One. Yeah, you pick. This is it. The two player. Yeah. All right, who are you gonna? Are you gonna do the jujitsu shit or? Yeah, I'll probably do jujitsu shit. I don't remember how it works, but. Eddie Brown. Guys look, this guy looks like Nelly. <laughs> Dude, it looks like Eddie Murphy with like some glasses on or something. Alright, my time ran out. I gotta be Bruno. That's whatever. Bruno's alright. You know, he was in um he was in like a Namco Capcom crossover game. I mean, let's just do the first one. Alright, parachute, it's parachute under the ship. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> These fucking Sega games, dude. Like, back in the day, they were just dumb fun. Arcades. We got the illustration. Alright, that's cool. How do I grab this guy? I think if you push B. Oh, wait, I'm jumping. Why? Oh, it is B. It is? Oh, there it is, dude. <laughs> Let me give this guy some Taekwondo, yeah. Yeah, you give a... I don't know when we got this, if we were like 10 or 11, but you give a kid that age this game and... Like... <laughs> Dude. I could repetitively play this over and over and over again. And love it, you know. Oh, this bartender guy, I was trying to get him. Oh, nice. My oh, prize yeah. weapon. Dude, the VMU beeps when you're near... Uh... The art gallery? Yeah, yeah, right the there. Illustration. illustration, yeah. Dude, I forgot about that. Yeah. Oh. My buttons feel a little sticky, but, nope. you know, what do you expect after probably more than a decade of not touching this thing? I remember that kick combo is like crazy. You get these uh, this illustration. That rare Sega art. Dude, I oh, remember- shit. Oh, shit. Nice, I got it. <laughs> Fucking ATB shit going on. Oh, QTE. Shenmu, QTE. Yeah. All right. Yeah, if you fail those, I don't even know what happens. I mean, you just go a different route, maybe that's harder. Um, I think it's like you fight the guy, 
Oh. Oh god. Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> That's why this game is awesome. All right. And then yeah, you can get this nuclear missile. All right. Once I am done beating the shit out of her. Oh no! Wait. That was a laser gun. Oh god. Frame rate. <laughs> it's too good. <laughs> I got the launcher. <laughs> Fucking dynamite oh, cop, dude. I love this shit. Oh god. Poor baby. Oh god, get off me, bitch. <laughs> they try they do that sliding thing, right? Yeah, oh, oh shit. Yeah, you gotta jump. Alright, let's trade partners. Dude, look at this woman. Holy shit. Fuck. Oh my. Did you get the nuke? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I got the nuke. Oh, damn. Oh, I lost my sleep. Oh, oh God, help. fuck off. Ada Mendoza. Can't believe they gave these characters last names. Hey, dude. They're all Hispanic, too. Gonzalez and Mendoza. <coughs> Hurry up with that bomb. Where is that girl? Where is that girl? Find her and bring her to me. <laughs> she hides in the suitcase. Yeah, it's like this pink, like, obvious suitcase just sitting there in the middle of the room. Oh, I got, a uh, Super Saiyan. Finally grabbed enough of those things. Oh, shit, that was like a Siegfried Soul Calibur combo. <laughs> oh, I love that double kick he does at the end. Oh, fuck. Alright, this guy's got the range. You gotta watch it before yeah, you go in. Yeah, that spear is good, I remember. Yeah, all the rod weapons, yeah. I love those things. Yeah, we're, do we're doing oh, good shit. on health. We're picking up enough. Picking up enough health, yeah, so... Shit, you, you got this one? Alright, I got it. <laughs> Dude, I don't think I had I, I pressed B, but I don't remember what that was. That was probably grab. Yeah, because kick is Y, right? Yeah. Oh, dude, you yeah, hit that the... guy, but the animation kept going. <laughs> I'm gonna kick this guy in the nuts. All right, yeah. The CQC shit's just wild. Oh fuck! This guy looks like a dangerous fisherman with Tommy guns. Fucking. Oh, pick him up. In the business. Cowboy Martinez. Slam you on the ground. I threw it on the ground. I got a magazine. Oh god. Dude, these guys have those guns. I remember these guys doing work. Oh yeah, they shoot on the ground. Oh dude. Nice. Not sure you can. Business. Nice, dude. Nice. A baguette. You know what? So yeah, this is route one. There's three. And I think the third one is the hardest. You got this one? I think it's left. I pressed it, but I don't know if I was the one that was registered. Is it on the left or right side, based on who you Yeah. Are? Dude, you've gotten all of them. <laughs> some reason There's I still remember. One. Oh yeah, I remember fighting in the game. Oh shit, okay, yeah, this is where the cigar is. You got- French roll. <laughs> French roll. I'm calling it a cigar because the first time I played this game at uh, Shane's house, <laughs> I thought it was a giant cigar. We were like 9 or 10. Dude, if you double tap, grab, it's like a dash, but I don't know what its use is. I normally press A to do that. Yeah, that? Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, you can do both. You're gonna need to know that for the end of the game when we uh, right. do our epic duel. Throw down. Oh shit. Give him the CQC. How do you do that? Do you just mash B? I don't know, you grab him and then you do like a punch combo. Oh god, oh god. These people do a ton of damage. No, 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 don't, don't pick that shit. God. That's classic beat em up, man. Like, you get into a loop of picking something up and then yeah. oh, they just keep fuck. beating you up. Shish kebab. Yo, who's hungry? Yeah, I, I do remember the shish kebab. <laughs> oh, who wants to get thrown? Oh, let me hit her with the French roll. Come on. Oh, yeah. Dude, this game's got, like, damage, too. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. Like, my, our shirts are, like, torn and shit. Yeah, if you pick up health, then, yeah, you regain your... Oh, what the hell? Yeah. Give me that hand axe. So, like, when you're down to critical, you look like a castaway. <laughs> I think it's down. Kick again, dude. Three in a row. I got you. 
<laughs> I got you. We'd be dead if it was up to me. I'll oh yeah, me. okay. Is that exit Rice there? cookers. All right. Oh, so yeah. Depending on the routes, I think is like who you fight. So we, we're getting this like classic Italian oh, chef guy. Fuck. But then I think in some we're parts. Shorts, dude. We're getting. Oh, All right, back. God, I got him. I got him. Jesus. Let me. Oh yeah, like you can end your um. Or something. Apple. All right, he's gonna slide. All right. I'm just eating these apples over here, you know. <laughs> I got you. I got you. Why is this guy carrying a carrot? I don't know, but I'm gonna go super. Oh, I think it's his knife. His ass. You know, if you could grab that guy, that'd be a good idea. He has a ton of health. Is there um? There's something I can use to kick this. Oh, hand grenades. All right, back up. I got this. Look out! Look out! Dude, yeah. How do you? What the fuck? That doesn't damage you. Shouldn't. Beer. I'll drink that shit. Let's drink. I'll, sh I'll drink that shit. Refrigerator. All right. Yeah, you got this. All right. Look out! Look out! All right. Nice. Nice. You got him. Um, but I don't think there's any other like items we can pick up. I think we just gotta brawl him for now. Whatever we can. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what Bruno's doing, man. Oh, he fucking did the Zangief. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna die, hell. <laughs> the Lariat move. He's almost done. Alright, we just gotta two side him. Pincer attack. Final Fantasy X. Got that. <laughs> Got that shit. Oh, you should get that. Oh, not enough Got time. time. And take the dumb waiter on down. I don't even know what's after this. Come to the desk. Never mind. Fucking look at this guy, man. Like. <laughs> oh, the cruise ship. Did we die? <laughs> that didn't signal failure. Oh yeah, that guy with the gun. Yo, you know what's ass. funny? Um, since we're playing a Sega game, I've been seeing articles that the Se uh, Sonic movies grossed a ton of money. Yeah, I heard it was doing really well, too. Oh, this is hairspray. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, if you get a lighter, you can use it with the hairspray. Doesn't, um, doesn't Gene, your character, start out with the lighter? Mm, I don't think so. It must be something you gotta pick up, like the handgun clip, or... Fuck. Oh, Damn, you got you got wrecked by Franklin right there. <laughs> I got perfect dark over here. This looks like joy in a dark. Air spray. Stop resisting. <laughs> Just spray with the hairspray. Stop resisting. That just reminds me of an episode of Cops I saw where uh, <laughs> this guy went up to this like really loopy looking dude, right? And then as soon as he just like confronted him or stopped him to talk to him, they he started fighting him. And the cop was like, stop resisting. <laughs> stop resisting. Fuck. I mean, it was probably terrifying for that cop in the moment, but you're nothing. Yeah, okay, dad. All right, I just lost the life. All right. Get a gun. Fuck. Time for some good eats. Why are you guys wearing crabs anyway? Get out of here with <laughs> that shit. Fuck. All right, I got the cinematic finish. Oh. Ooh, I shot him. Oh, you can eat that tuna. Hell no. No time. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Help me. I know this is Resident Evil. Do the fucking voice acting. It's like, hey, you work here? Yeah. yeah you wanna be? In <laughs> you wanna be in this game? Help me. Find her and bring her to me. Dude, have you ever seen any of those compilations on YouTube of the really bad voice acting? Yeah, I've seen a few. Of them. Have you seen the one? You've seen that one with the DS game, right? Where the dude like hired his own yeah, family. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy fuck! 
I would be so <laughs> I would be so goddamn pissed if I was the publisher. It's just so unacceptably bad. Where I came from. I'm trying to get back to where I came from. <laughs> this fucking god awful. This is getting beat up. Alright, I got this guy. Fuck. Oh, there's a big missile pod over here. Yeah, there's two of them. But that's because we have to fight. You know, the guns Bunch of jumbos? Yeah. Alright. There's a health shit. over here if you want to get it. Oh shit, he's got the good- Oh, that's you. I don't All even right. know how to drop this. Just go over by here and push uh, X to pick it up. There you go, there's a health. Oh, damn. Oh, it made me drop that thing. Oh, I guess oh, we're not- yeah. Oh, we're shit. This guy's actually kind of tough. There's a harpoon gun over here. Yeah, we gotta use these weapons, because this guy is, uh... You can't even get over there with them. Um, here, I'll use the wrench. This thing's just called water gun. You know? That's pretty fast. Oh, dude, he has like little squidlings or something. Yeah, and then you cough on him. I remember that. <laughs> just shooting him with this thing back here. All right, I guess I'll be the decoy. Oh, Jesus. Spin that fucking wrench on him. His ass. His eyes, like, die away when you hit him or something. Okay, nice, we got him. Speaking of which, my eyes got dilated. Can you see now? Yeah, it's a little better now. Wait, are you gonna explain that uh, eye appointment? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't, nothing. Oh, he's like sitting on the suitcase. Does he know that she's in there? I wonder if that's... Oh, I forgot about this. I wonder if that's, um... <laughs> Dude, you're gonna die if you're not careful. Oh, God! <laughs> Dude, we've, like, evened out the health. Track, right? I wanted the health so bad. Nah. Dude, look at that secret hideout. Oh, my God. This has been unknown oh. to the Navy. For the longest time. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing is, you know, that cruise ship couldn't have been that far from this secret hideout in the middle of nowhere. Oh, yeah, and they have like whatever the hell this thing is. <laughs> Genetic <laughs> defect. That dude was trolling in the window. Yeah. Oh, God. Dude. Find her bridge. Is this Madonna? Yeah, there's a, it's like a BDSM club or something. All these people are wearing this question. Dude, this guy looks like he's straight out of Fist of the North Star. This, this that dude you were shooting. Like half Luke King, half Mad Max. <laughs> yeah, if they hunch over, yeah, don't keep shooting because they're trying to get you to waste that ammo. Do you remember those uh, like black skin with the white? Like, oh, I think we're gonna fight hey, those guys now. Yeah, it's like a hidden. Yeah, there's like some tiki yeah. evil, whatever the hell's going on down here. Some juju kaka. <laughs> oh yeah, and they like, yeah, yeah. You beat them and they uh, multiply. Okay, he didn't multiply it. Oh, they did the first time. God, that's so sick. Oh no! I thought he was gonna throw me into the guillotine. We got Captain of the Dead over here. Oh, guillotine! Dude, this guy's getting bodied by that. Holy shit! Speedrun strats. Oh no! No! I'm sorry, I failed you. <laughs> Oh shit, okay. This is like actually challenging for once because we don't really know. Yeah. We got this enclosed space. Whew. Anyway, yeah, I don't know. I just had an eye appointment to get an updated prescription. Apparently my eyes are really fucking bad. And uh, there's one funny part. 
you know, when they do that shit that, you know, it's like one or two, one or two, three or four. They well, just, I've never, I've never yeah, been to right. an optometrist. Just... <laughs> but so this isn't like the EAD thing, right, where you cover your eye. This is like some... No, yeah, well, I don't know what you mean. Like, Well, you know, like the vision test. Yeah, it's like a vision test. But at the doctor, you know when you have the, the letters in the background? Yeah, yeah, they have that. Okay, is it similar to that, or...? Yeah, I mean, it, it's like you put your hand, your face in like a device, and they cover one eye. And the device has like, I don't know, lenses that they can switch out. So they're basically just asking as they switch these lenses back to because forth, of like which one is better. And it uses like a like a you know, a, a letter chart, you know, of varying sizes or whatever to ask you about it. So they have a certain size letter, you know, up there and then they'll they'll switch them back and forth and be like, is one better or two? Is three better or four? And they'll just go back and forth and back and forth. And my right eye is terrible. Sure. I got okay, it. You got it. Um, my red eye is terrible, and so she was on like one of the the largest letters, and I I was like, oh dude, I wasn't even paying attention. Yeah, I, I saw that at the last <laughs> second. I fucking nailed it. But, um. but uh, I could hardly see even the high, even the like largest letter, but I could tell that it was a D. So I was like, okay, well I know that it's a D. Dude, a bow and arrow? Are you kidding me? I could tell that it was a D, but you know it was really faded out. Uh, so, you know, so she's making it slightly, she makes it slightly more, uh, visible. It beca it's like as if it, um, in like a word processor or something, if you would bold the letters. Okay. That's kind of the difference. So, like, every time it would be like it just got bolder and bolder and bolder as you, as your vision, like, cleared up. So I was like, oh, you know, like, I can see this D, but I have, like, double vision from it being out of focus. So it's like I saw a D and then, like, a D below it. So, uh, you know, so I, I was talking about how, you know, I was concerned. Oh, dude, this guy's... Watch out! Son of a bitch, traitor. I was concerned because I had this double vision of the D. I'm like, well, you know, I can see that it's a D, but I see, like, two copies of it. And it's not really getting better. So she goes through two or three different things where it's getting slightly better, slightly better. And then all of a sudden, you know, I just, like, had an epiphany. And I was like, oh, my God, this isn't a D with a D below it. It's a fucking capital B. It's a D. capital B. And I, it's just, you know, like, it looks like two Ds. Okay. Yeah, so, so I fucking, like, couldn't see, like, enough. And I thought that, like, originally when I saw it, my vision was so bad that I couldn't see that defining line in the middle of the B. It just looked like a D. But yeah, so I, I started fucking laughing, like, really hard, and she started laughing, and she was like, you know, I'm glad that you can finally see that it's a B. Yes, it is indeed a B. And I was just like, Help Jesus me. Christ. There wasn't anything with the doctor being like similar age or just yeah i mean it was kind of weird because she was she was younger than well i don't know if she was younger but she was like sh way shorter than me Dude, this fucking guy all right this guy is like all about the counters i i remember he's all about the counters so you gotta kind of all right yeah he's gonna just challenge me Oh shit, I can't fucking... Oh my god, I just fell. Damn. Is there a way to even see how many lives you have left? I assume we're gonna make it? I gotta warp away from him so you don't get countered. There we go, teamwork. Gotta open him up, open him up. Oh shit, did that hit you? I think so, alright. Yeah, you gotta do that boost. Oh yeah, he thing. does that spinny. All right, I'm thing. out. Oh, I'm okay. Yeah, maybe we have like unlimited. I don't know. These are the same memory cards from how many years ago. So if there is. All right, now he's just trolling. Oh shit. He's just. <laughs> Dude, I was gonna hit him first, but. Happy birthday. Hey, just dodge it. You get him? No. Got him. Uh. <laughs> Did he say anything? Thank you for Oh my, my god, life. look at this. Oh my god, that fucking. F I will ask Papa to give a reward to the stronger of you two. That's all right, Shane. You know how this goes. Wait, yo, hold up. 
I'm gonna <laughs> give you the fucking pipe. <laughs> Just concede, you're at my house, you are the guest. You don't want to be rude now, do you? Don't oh, shit! <laughs> no, no, don't. <laughs> Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yo, what get the on the fuck? fucking ground. Get this ground. shit out of my face. All right, he who gets the fucking rod. God damn it! This is why they don't let women into the. <laughs> you son of... Oh, I got something for your ass. Come here, Shane. Come here, Shane. <laughs> No! No! <laughs> How do you like that? No, don't How do, do it. Like that? Don't do it. Don't do the fucking King Tekken move. Alright. Oh, big fucking mistake. No! <laughs> no! No! Oh, oh! Oh! What you gonna do, boy? No! 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 You can't be getting that. Oh! No, 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 no! Oh Hell yeah! Oh Hell fuck, there's yeah. continues. It Dude, keeps it going. Gave me full life too. So until somebody like gives up. <laughs> Whoever gets it this time is for sure the winner. Oh my god, my fucking balls, dude, have some <laughs> Oh DDT! Son of a bitch. Don't get yourself back into a fuck. <laughs> No! No! Yeah! That fucking juggled me! <laughs> What's the matter, boy, huh? Alright, I'm gonna try hey, to use... you like some of that? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you are... You are a fucking yeah, bastard, what's, what's you know that? Huh? You are a fucking bastard! Huh? Yeah, you like that? Oh, oh, shit. oh! Oh! Get the... No! Get out of my house! No! No! <laughs> I'll take that. You better stay you there. Bitch. You better stay there. You fucking you know bitch. You, you knew going, about man. the goddamn rod, and you fucking <laughs> get any guy into the corner of the thing, and then you do the horizontal attack, <sighs> the punch button, and you got him in an infinite loop. Good baby, feels good, baby. What's this shadow? Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah. You guys are like best fucking friends now. You can go shopping together. The future is female. Oh shit! Does it go right into its mouth? <laughs> oh, look at those! Look at that explosion! Dude, she just like kicked that dude in the head. What is this? State of the art, man. State of the art. God. Oh. Well, that land was claimed by the government, and uh, it's a brand new Guantanamo Bay. You know, I actually remember looking at the gallery in this game. Uh, it was like one of the first games I ever played that had an art gallery of like, uh, I don't know what it would be, uh, like developmental, you know, what's it called, like... Concept art? Yeah, yeah, concept <laughs> art. Yeah, it had like concept <laughs> art and... Well, this know. is like, this is like way back when Sega was actually relevant and doing their own thing. They were on their last legs, but they actually gave a shit, they weren't just putting out Sonic and Yakuza games. Thank you for point. Yeah, but this was originally an arcade game. They just poured this over the Dreamcast. Well, it was still made by Sega. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just saying, like, I, I wonder if they made it easier, because when you think of arcade game, you think, you know, like, they want you to keep putting, like, some House of the Dead 2 shit, where you need $55 and quarters to beat that game. House uh, of the Dead was really broken. I mean, if you do the... Yeah, but look at this. Like, they had a manga for this shit. Damn. Isn't that crazy, dude? Did all this, like, uh... Why would they go this far for Dynamite Cod? That's what I mean. Dude, can I leave? How do I get out of this? I Did you push B? It. Yeah. Press the B button? Okay, there we go. Um... But yeah, you collect those illustrations in-game, and then you find them in this gallery. And I remember looking through these, and it was just like... You know, you see them in-game, and it's this crappy polygon, like, Dreamcast-era 3D, you know, whatever. It's kind of whack. But then you see these concept art images, and some of them are like really, really high detail. Like, whoa, like this is what they were going for? They had these crazy ones of the enemies. I mean, they really, they really don't look like those designs. Like, they have like very intricate, um, you know, like 
one pant leg and stuff like that, and then you get to the game and they just have basic camo. Yeah, these are the tubbies. <laughs> they don't look as... Dude, she looks way bigger in the 3D model. Or, I mean, she's still got, you know... You know, you're like, you're talking about the pixelation and the, the whack, and it's like, oh, that just was... Man, baby. That was just Ooh. Dreamcast graphics in a nutshell, man. Like, in between PlayStation 1 and PS2, you were no right. It's like, not as powerful as... Well, was it as powerful as PS2? Well, I mean, my point is like, you know, when you were that young or when you played on those systems, that's all you had was the in-game graphics. You didn't necessarily have concept art or illustrations to show you, like what that is supposed to actually be in like hide you know. kind of funny a lot of these are missing but i remember there is i don't think they're yeah i don't know which one it was but yeah, there's definitely one on here that was like some babe in a bikini i remember glancing at that one good old like old sheen fat material you know i don't gotta get was... all the get all the gallery the all the illustration i don't think it was that uh or whatever and I, I wonder if these are like references this thing's called rocket boy i can fly i can fly i just can't like go i don't know the lyrics but is that a reference to like rocket elton i don't john? think so i don't think that's elton john yeah but yeah there was just a whole bunch of them that's where the vmu is going off like crazy so jumbo mats hey you fight some sumo guy see that's the thing um the jumbo that guy when you go into the kitchen, mm -hmm. depending on what path you take, you fight a different jumbo guy. So we fought like the basic chef guy. Then there's a sushi Yang. guy. Yeah, that's him. And Master then... Yang is the sushi guy. Yeah. Master of Chinese cuisine. I really like fighting the uh, the sushi guy or whatever it is, because he's got like the um, <laughs> Dude, little rice cookers you can Ada throw. Ada Mendoza used to work as a sideshow attraction in a circus. This one's just called Big Rear View. Unfortunately, we don't have this one. Uh, I think that's for the best. Whew. I think that's for the best. Belly Dancer. Hint 1, listen to your memory card. Hint 2, try attacking suspicious place. Because the VMU beeps when you take over one, but maybe there's other hidden ones. They're trying to justify somebody spending 50 bucks on this. Kind of interesting, though, because... I mean, I, I don't think this existed in the arcade. This, oh, like, of course not. Right? No. So, so they must have just been like, hey guys, we need more content to warrant like making this a you know console game. Let's just add some like bonus art and shit we had lying around the office. And herbs on the side about it. I don't know, it's just kind of charming. It's like an older game. I don't think they do this really much. I just wish I could play the first one. You know, this is the second game and the first one I, I would play in the arcades as a kid, but I never really got to see it. Um on a console or anything like that. I think it might have been on uh, Sega Saturn and then ported to Steam or whatever. However, people get a hold of that imported version with Bruce Willis in it. I don't think there's anything really... Yeah, there's like some weird uh, bonus games and stuff that you can play. But yeah, I think, I think that's about it. Unless like you do another path because if you do like path two or three, I think three is the hardest. And, um, yeah, they, they range in, uh, difficulty. Use... Detonator pack? Probably like a Dreamcast, uh, Rumble thing. Probably something like that. You can turn friendly fire on and off. I wish we had more Dreamcast games to play. <laughs> I wanna fuck around with these cheesy-ass games and... ...have some dumb fun. But yeah. Well, that's Dynamite Cop, guys. Dynamite Cop. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed it. I mean, we're kind of just doing this as a side gig. You know, so if we have another one, we'll upload it right away. And if you ever want to watch any corny games, just, you know, look for the Shane and, Shane and Matt playthrough. <laughs> so we'll see you guys later. Catch you later.